In this problem, we have a diagram of an electric field line setup with two points labeled A and B. Part A of the problem tells us that there is a proton at point A and that the electric field at the point where point A is located has a magnitude of 40 newtons per coulomb. We're asked to find the magnitude of the force on the proton at point A. This problem is fairly simple, as long as you recall that the force, due to an electric field, is equal to the charge on the particle immersed within the electric field, multiplied by the strength of the electric field itself. In the case of this problem, or part A, that force is going to be equal to the charge on that proton, which is just going to be the same charge as you would expect for any proton, positive 1.6, multiplied by 10 to the power of negative 19 coulombs, multiplied by our electric field strength, 40 newtons per coulomb. If we put this into a calculator, then we find that the force at part A has a magnitude of 6.4, multiplied by 10 to the power of negative 18 newtons. So that is our answer to part A of the problem. Part B of the problem asks us to find the magnitude of the electric field where part B, where point B is on the left-hand side of the diagram. Something that's useful to remember is that by convention, the, ele the, the strength of the electric field is proportional to the crowdedness of the field lines. So because the problem tells us that the electric field lines on the left have twice the separation of those on the right, that means that the electric field on the left is half as strong as the electric field on the right. So to write this out mathematically, the electric field at point A is twice as strong as the electric field at point B. Or, the electric field at point B is half as strong as the electric field at point A. Since the problem tells us that the electric field at point A is equal to 40 newtons per coulomb, that means that the electric field strength at point B must be half of that, or 20 newtons per coulomb. That's the answer to part B, and so that's the answer to all of this problem. And that is it for this video. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please consider subscribing, as it'll help me out in making more videos like this. And if you have a question, leave a comment down below, and I'll do my best to help you out as best as I can. If you have a request for a future video, or you just like to hang out, my Discord server and my Twitch page, and my other YouTube channels, are all linked in the description below. So check those out if you'd like. But that's all for now, and I hope you all have a lovely day. Bye bye